why was that transition difficult for you when you went into that system? Um, a lot of the calls at LSU and Bama have, you know, similar names with different meanings. And it was more of a fact of just, you know, unlearning for me than, you know, learning everything. Um, that was the main, you know, thing of it. That's what I think it was. Who's the best route runner you face in the game this year? In the game, I would probably say Malik Neighbors or Keishon Butte. What's about Malik? It's about RDC and... Um, he's very patient at the line. Um, not at, he's not a physical receiver, but he's real slick. Um, that's, that's what I would say. Um, Did you uh, go up against him in practice uh, previously in LSU? How, you know how that, did he grow this year? You know that. Um, he came in as a freshman. I see you know, some of the same personality as I have um, just on offense. You know, so I always cater to him, helped him, always pushed him. And, um, he's a real dog. And I respect him. What's Kool Aid McKinstry like? What's, what's, is he going to be up here next year? Uh, I think he should be. You know, he's determined. You know, we had our talks. Um, you know, he wants to be the top cornerback in the next draft. And, you know, I think he has a good chance to do it. What stands out most about him? Um, very patient, very smart, um, has a good feel for the game, um, has a good knack for the ball as well. After the Sugar Bowl, you were still deciding about whether to go to the draft. Is what ultimately led you to enter the draft? Um, basically, it was just whether or not I felt ready and um, whether I could benefit an NFL team or not. And I feel like I could benefit an NFL team this year. So that's really why I made the decision to declare. Did you consider the transfer portal at all? In that? Not once. And just in terms of, did they tell you like a projected round when you're trying to get some advice? On yeah, they um told me um what kind of projections I was getting, but um it really didn't come down to that. It really came down to whether I felt ready and whether I felt I could help an NFL team. And then back yeah, in the spring, you know, people were talking about you as a yeah, top yeah, ten yeah, pick. Yeah. How much did you pay attention to that, and did that affect you at all during the season? Um, I'm really just playing. Um, I don't really look into the media. I'm barely on social media as it is. So um, the coach statement told me, you know, just work, stay focused. I was at a whole new school, whole new program, and all I was focused on was, you know, getting used to the coach out there.